yeah hello uh, yeah so uh, we are trying uh, we have built a, a driver for the shukam 3 to support uh, on the shakti board uh, so we basically studied the data sheet uh, and using uart uh, yeah we are sending and receiving the commands and uh, get, getting the picture yeah about our project uh, to take the picture uh, using this camera on the shakti board uh, now we will go through the code and uh, show the demonstration of working of our code uh, yeah so uh, this is the main uh, here uh, yeah we are just setting the pinmux configuration properly and setting the baud rate to uh, 115 to 00 and uh, yeah we are calling the init cam function uh, to initialize the camera uh, to wake the camera basically actually the you can the camera will sleep after 15 seconds so to start any process uh we need to wake the camera yeah giri can you go to you can not see yes okay so yeah can you go to uh, uh the init cam here uh yeah basically yeah we have to send the sync commands yeah we will be continuously uh, sending the sync commands Uh, with with some delay time, like we are starting with initially with four four milliseconds, and afterwards, yeah, four then five then six and so on. So after a few rounds, uh, we should be able to wake up the camera. Yeah, that's all. Uh, this function is about, and yeah, this uh, we are following the data sheet given by the manufacturer. Uh, okay, yeah. Give me an explanation about get pick now. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So, so once in this init camera, it returns minus one if we can't wake up the camera, or returns zero if it's all successful. So as you can see in the main. So after this, we are coming to get pick. So get pick is to just. Uh, so the process of getting the picture is according to the data sheet. We just we have to send a. first the command to set uh, about what kind of picture do we get so that is this initial command uh, here we have just set it to jpeg jpeg picture and then the, uh, for receiving the picture uh, we set we first set the package size and package size we have set it to be 256 256 bytes per each package and then we send the get picture command so this is this uh, this per this this command is for getting the current jpeg picture so uh, yeah and so these are all just to check whether the received format is correct or not and then we can calculate the so from this uh, the first the you can uh, responds with the size of the image that it's going to send so once we find that we know that each package size is 256 also according to the data sheet according to the data sheet they have said uh, that the packets uh, each packet the first four bytes are just for checking or uh, the first two bytes are id second uh, then next it's data size and then the last two bytes are for checking so we just have to take the middle remaining bytes for our a uh, jpeg image so essentially 250 bytes in each packet is uh, for the data so we divided by 250 to find the number of packages that we'll get and the last package will be varying size depend on the depending on the what is the size now we can see this receive image function what we do is uh, we just get all the 256 bytes and we 
we just print the we leave the first four and the last two and print the rest so that we can process it yeah so that's it get pick command is get pick uh, function is this much yeah. okay so this is camera receive image dot c so in this c code uh, we are connecting to a port so that is specified by this uh, argument that we get and so we are op basically in this uh, in this code we are just uh, opening the port and then writing and reading from it so the the uh, the header files from C that we have to include here are these, especially this term .h, which con uh, contains all the functions for reading and writing from the port. So here we set uh, we set the features of this particular what should be the communication that we do. So this is set uh, in general for since we are doing using UART, so this is set for UART, uh, UART mode. And then, OK, so reading the image starts from here. here uh, similar, whatever data that we got from the camera, we are just sending it uh, first so that we can read from here what is the exact number of size, exact number of bytes that we, uh, of the whole image. So once we get the exact number of size, uh, we do uh, we do a malloc, and then we allocate that much memory. And after we do this, we send a, uh, a confirmation to the Shakti board so that both both of these processes are in sync. So after that, we just read all the bytes that we get. Once we get all the, all of them, uh, we open a new dot jpeg in file and then write everything onto the file after doing this full thing we send a, again a confirmation to the board so that we can go on with the next image so this this function is this code is for uh, getting an image in continuous mode that's why we have a while loop it can be changed to just have one single image and etc so now, yeah, we can go for compiling. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so, so initially, uh, we will compile. Okay. You, okay. Then, uh, so, you be... This is for compiling the you can test the receive image dot c code that we just saw. So once both of these are compiled, we can start. have to create images folders uh, in the directory where yeah. uh, receive image dot c uh, yeah so in this so yeah we can see that a dot is generated just uh, have a new folder for images and all the images will be stored here like you can modify the code uh, to take input as a file path, uh, but yeah, for simplicity, yeah, we are doing this. So, 
So you can start. We can see that it's and, waiting. And we can start this also. Simultaneously, both are started. And we can see that. Uh, yeah, here. The sender this is image. from the board. Yeah. And this yeah. is and receive image. Dot so continuously, uh, we are receiving the images. Uh, you can stop when you want to stop. So, yeah, this is terminated. And then just open this. Images, yeah. We'll be able we to see. Nice parity. Yes. All the yeah, these are the images taken. In, uh, like it was kept at static position. We didn't move that much. So. So yeah, we are getting the same image. Yeah, that's all. Thanks for watching the video.